We're going to San Jose Trailhead over in Denellen, Florida. I was reading the reviews on this and apparently there is a lot of fish. So this is the pond next to Blue Run. So Blue Run is uh, uh, the springs on Rainbow River where you can kayak and all that. And then this is a runoff pond next to it. So it probably won't be as clear, but probably better conditions for some bass. But yeah, as you can see, it's a little, I mean, bass are gonna love that, but it's a little gross looking. Doing a little exercise today. Yep. Do, 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 do. It's gonna, it's like perfect out. It's not too hot, but it's also still pretty uh this is a beautyberry bush it's the main ingredient that's in uh, mosquito spray back in the day they used to crush that up and put it under their saddles the soldiers and the seminoles to try to keep the mosquitoes away sand hill loop trail you think we should try that no that's uh, the bike trail one day we'll have a boat guys but for now, you just get to listen to me talk about plants. <laughs> yeah, here's some more of it. But it's called Beautyberry because these turn like a bright pinkish red, beautiful color when it's, when it's bloomed. But yeah, if you crush it up, it smells literally like bug spray. All right, guys, I'm gonna stop you. I'll turn it back on if we find a spot. Might have to go elsewhere, guys. These trees are causing a problem. And the frickin' pond scum. What the frick? Oh, I got your line. All right, so we are at Cooter, Cooter Pond. It has been a long day. Literally just trying to find somewhere to fish without a boat. There's so many woods and stuff in Florida. Oh, that what about you? How are you looking? Are you blown out too? She got off though. The only thing that sucks is like there's some like dense, dense plants around here. So I'm trying to, oh, I'm trying to get it out there further. But the second I start reeling it in, it starts getting stuck in these. Gonna keep on moving. feeling it's gonna be one of those days don't y'all hate when like you start sweating and like sunscreen gets in your eyes or is that just me probably just me I feel like I'm the only person that ever has these type of problems if everything's blowing this way my theory is is that the fish are gonna be this way
came in, I, we saw some um, bluegill and some bait fish, so there's got to be some bass in here. We just got to figure out where they're all at. This might be the ticket over here. Oh yeah, look at that. But are they down there? That is the question. The water is clear. I'm not seeing them. There's another gator going that way towards the right. Gators are probably eating all the bass. If I don't catch anything, that's what happened. The gators ate all the bass. <laughs> Every single one. All I'm doing is getting stuck in the damn grasses. Fetch your asses. We stuck in the grasses. Oh God, here come some people. Better stop being weird. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to show you this gator because he's kind of cute. There he is. Doing gator stuff. See, like he's even having to press against the current. So I'm thinking everything's getting pushed this way. Oh, look at how cute him is. Hi, buddy. Such a crazy creature. Don't go after my. No, don't go after my thing. I'll feel bad. I don't want to get you. No, 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 no. All right, I guess I'm going to pause and come back if I get something. So we finally found a place we could fish off of the freaking thing and gosh, they're freaking flopping around y'all. We have to risk our lives to get there. Careful. Have a freaking rock slide. Oh my goodness. This is like freaking fishing in Colorado all over again. All right. Oh my God, guys. Do you see these freaking bass? Oh my God. This is amazing. What do you think it is then? Those look like trout. I've never seen that. It's so cool. Here, can you go a little more? No, because I'm going to hit this tree. Super dumb. I hooked the whole freaking tree branch. Goodness gracious. <laughs> These are like rookie fish. Bad luck today. I'd like to get under these trees, but with our luck today, I'll probably get, oh God, damn it. Probably get stuck. Honestly, I probably wouldn't even be biting this. This looks like a damn leaf. Should have kept my other one that I had. But yeah, this Placosmus over there, he don't give a damn. He is just chilling. Straight chilling. Oh, there's two. Man, those things are huge. They are not interested in this, that's for sure. Which is fine, because I'm not trying to catch them. But 
But there's also no bass over here, so. Crazy. So you guys can, when it rains like this, you can really see all the gators' heads out there. Hopefully it'll pass because I do see the sun over there. We did get a couple bites on the dock and of course it starts raining. What are you going to end up using? Black and blue by rain dig. Yeah. Black and blue tail. Cool. Damn it, babe, we need the net. It's huge. We need the net. It's huge. Baby, come help me. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Get it in here. Oh my god, you guys, look at it. The line, baby, tighten your line. I'm sorry, I'm so excited. Tighten your line. Baby, look at the Oh my god, do you have the scale? Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> Y'all, look at this fish! We gotta get the scale on this bad boy. Bring his jaw down. It's my biggest one yet, and I'm so excited. Alright. Let me see it on the camera. Two, two pounds, pounds, two, two ounces. Up. Yeah, baby. Rolling like a big shot. Chevy tuned up like a NASCAR pit stop. Alright, so let me go. Hey, just throw them back in. I don't want to hurt him. Dropping down like this? Yeah, unfortunately we can't can't do anything. Yep, see he's good. Watch him float back to the top. <laughs> good job, babe. Thank you. He took my whole freaking Guggen worm. Ate the whole thing. Alright, so we are at the fifth stop today. Yep, still no best. <laughs> well, except for yours. And we brought our special needs. German Shepherd Husky. That's probably gonna hook himself on that. Great. He's scared of everything, so hopefully he'll uh look at all those birds up there swarming. Alright, here he goes. Rookie's very concerned about his dad crossing the water. Oh there you go. Good job. <laughs> That's commitment, ladies and gentlemen. That is commitment. Okay, there could be gators. Uh-uh, you're gonna scare the fish. You don't even like the water. We're just gonna chill over here. Nice. So there's this boat over here. I'll show you guys. Actually, somebody might be living in it. Sorry, don't want to disturb them. <laughs> Never know in Florida. Yep. Alright, so we're gonna walk around here. And I guess this is where it ends.